I thought I could stop wearing these things. I tried, honestly, I tried. I haven't had a stitch of them on for nearly two weeks until tonight. Then I couldn't stand it anymore. I had to put the moniker out of my mind. Nature makes mistakes. It's proven every day. This person is a transvestite, a man who is more comfortable wearing girls' clothes. The term transvestite is the name given by medical science to those persons who wear the clothing of the opposite sex. Many a transvestite actually wishes to be the opposite sex. The title of this can only be labeled Behind Locked Doors. Give this man satin undies, a dress, a sweater, and a skirt, or even the lounging outfit he has on, and he's the happiest individual in the world. He can work better, think better, he can play better, and he can be more of a credit to his community and his government because he is happy. These things are his comfort. But why the wig and makeup? He dares to enter the street dressed in the clothes he so much desires to wear, but only if he really appears female. The long hair, the makeup, the clothing, the actual contours of a girl. You did look much better as a girl than you do as a man. Glenn did wear the dress to the Halloween party. He even took first prize. Then one day it wasn't Halloween any longer. <laughs> 